Hi everyone, it's Trish with Bird Feed. Welcome back to my channel for ideas and inspiration for your Operation Christmas Child shoeboxes. Today's shoebox unboxing is for an older girl, aged 10 to 14, and this one has a tropical theme. So let's start with her t-shirt. It's just a solid colored t-shirt. It's a ladies size small in a very pretty coral color. It's a Gildan brand t-shirt that I picked up at the Dollar Tree for $1. But to spice it up, I also found at the Dollar Tree this really pretty, this scarf in coral with other colors of turquoise and lime green, orange, and there's some silver running through it. It's a really long scarf, just really pretty. And I thought she could wear it around her head, around her neck, around her waist, and that makes for a pretty shirt and outfit. Um, I've also given her this sparkly headband, it was one of a three pack I think I got from the Dollar Tree. And this one is coral, coral and silver. She has a, a little plush. It's one I picked up at a thrift store for 50 cents. It's a Thai beanie boo and her name is Dainty. I think Dainty, this might be the one, had a had something hanging from her beak that I snipped off. Um, I didn't like it. It looked like a, a, a big jelly bean to me in uh, like a, this color, pink satin. And um, I just took it off. So she's got a little something to love and cuddle. She has a water bottle. This one has flamingos all over it. I picked this one up at the Dollar Tree last year or the year before, I believe. It's a nice big water bottle and in it, I've got three bouncy balls. They're clear with little red hearts. She's got uh, several pairs of socks. Uh, they're all tropical and I got them at Hobby Lobby in a three pack back when they were still doing their 40% off coupons, and I think I paid $2 for the three pack. This is one pair with the flamingos on it. The other two are at the bottom of the bottle here. She's got, this is her other uh, only toy, I mean, to speak of in, in the box. It's a little blind bag doll. It was a blind bag. I opened it to make sure there wasn't anything objectionable inside. This is a Trinity and Beyond doll, and it was on clearance at Walmart for like, I don't know, I don't think I paid more than a, a buck for it. Um, this is Splash Time Madison. Splash Time Madison. And I just cut out a little picture from the packaging because when I put it in, the bottle, she had, her head has to go in sideways, so I have to take her apart. And I just want her to make sure that she knows it goes together. She's cute, she has a little, this is a removable daisy on the top of her head. I don't know if her hair is removable. No, I don't think so. But I think it's just the body and her flower and her head are removable, but she's cute. <laughs> She has a, a coral colored toothbrush, coral and gray with a coral cap. Her, another pair of socks has pineapples on it. And the last pair of socks, this is only one of the pair, the other one is in, in, still in the box, has palm trees on it. So yellow, orange, and turquoise. And she's got a face mask. I, I tucked one of these inside, it says no bad days on it. 
This came in a five pack, I believe, from Walmart for a couple of bucks on clearance. She's got a couple of combs in there and a little flamingo puffball keychain. And this I got for 30 cents on clearance at Dollar General a little while back. I thought that was cute. So that's what's in her water bottle. And there you can see it. All the flamingos now without anything in it, BPA free. That's from the Dollar Tree. Here's her other pair, her, her other sock that goes with her pair. And it's protecting a pair of sunglasses. This is a, a nice pair of sunglasses. An adult pair that I got on clearance at Walmart for $1.50. It's kind of a blush pinky coral color with like a copper uh, around the rim. Kind of hard to tell with all that glare, but it's really pretty, kind of pearlized looking. And I thought it went really well with her shirt. I thought it was pretty. She's got a jump rope. She's got a full-sized backpack. This is one of those stuffable backpacks. You can stuff it back into its own pocket and snap it for storage. And it's a really pretty print in this coral and aqua coloration. I like that. Bar of soap I'd put into a plastic bag. She does have a face cloth. I've given her a six pack of reusable pads and in here I also stuffed a couple pairs of underwear. One is a girl's size 1416 in this aqua color and one is a ladies size small in the peachy coral color. And then her reusable pads are also kind of tropical. Uh, there's two of these with the flamingos on it. There's two of these with dragonflies on it. And there's two with ladybugs on it. I included in with her pads this little illustrated instruction guide on how to fold and uh, wear the pads and how to wash them. And this comes from blessingsinashoebox.com. You can get them free on their website. I'm happy I was able to fit these in because as many of you know, a lot of these girls can't go to school if they can't um, take care of their cycle and they have to stay home. So this helps them do that. And I wasn't able to fit this in the wet bag with the six pads, but I also included a bar of laundry soap that I got from Walmart. 98 cents. And then uh, on the bag, I taped with packing tape, uh, clear packing tape, another part of the instructions. I just cut this off. The, so the laundry part of the instructions. So she'll know that that's what this is for. It also says laundry bar on it. So hopefully that's enough to let her know what this is for. Her spiral notebook is cool. Um, I found this, you know, I'm not sure where I found it, either at the Dollar Tree or at Walmart on clearance at one point in time. It says, be happy on it with these tropical letters. But I, I like that for this shoe box. It's great. For a coloring book, I found this at the Dollar Tree, The Tropical Pinky Life. Very cute and very tropical. There's a lot of cute tropical pictures in it. So it's real cute. A lot of flamingos. Might be all flamingos. <laughs> and then some tropical stickers. I included flamingos, of course. And then an assortment of tropical birds. Some puffy tropical stickers. And then here are some more 
just funny tropical stickers. So she's got plenty of stickers and the stickers are for a journal that I fit in there in this kind of a pinky coral color. Um, I thought the rainbow was appropriate for the tropical theme. It says, after the storm comes the rainbow, and it's just a lined journal, and I think she'll have fun putting stickers in her journal and writing about her, her day. She has a very sparkly pencil pouch. It has glitter in it. I got it on clearance at Dollar General. I think it was only 50 cents. Uh, in it, I've put eight pencils, four number twos, and four decorated ones that have rainbows and butterflies and flowers on them. And she's also got a, I guess this is a mechanical pencil. This came in a pack from Walmart for 10 cents, I think, nine cents for the pack. Um, after Valentine's Day, I just put one in there. And um, I always like to give uh, three colors of pens, black, blue, and red, to the 10 to 14s. Um, on her number two, four number two pencils, I put cap erasers. She's got a yellow highlighter, a pink scissor, I've given her a couple of pencil sharpeners. She has a big pink eraser and a uh, unicorn eraser. And then she also has these little fish crayons. So just a little extra for her to have. And then I've given her these three little highlighters. I just recently got these at Target from the Dollar Spot. Uh, their summer clearance. They were 10 cents, purple, blue, and green. So she's got some fun things in her pencil pouch. I've also given her uh, this ruler that I just got at Menards for a quarter. It's one of those flexible rulers, has both centimeters and inches on it. I think it's really cool. Really like that. And She's got a funny novelty pen. This one was uh, 15 cents from Dollar General, but I put it in here because it reminded me of a flamingo. I just thought it was kind of funny looking and I thought that would be cute with her journal. I've given her a cute charm necklace that has replaceable charms. This one has on it now a flamingo and palm tree, but you can replace the charms with the little mermaid scale heart, the watermelon, or the pineapple charm. And this I got at Walmart for a dollar on clearance. Here's her colored pencils for her uh, coloring book. A little roll of clear plastic tape in a flamingo dispenser. I know many of you might have seen these at the Dollar Tree. That's where I got it. I've given her a little change purse. I think it was 30 cents on clearance from Walmart. She can even attach this to her uh, book bag, her backpack. And in it, she has a lip balm and some hair accessories. I think that's all I've got in here now, hair accessories. So I've given her um, six hair elastics in the bright tropical colors, aqua, yellow, and coral. And, oh, she's got uh, nail clippers. Put her nail clippers in here and a nail brush. Forgot I put those in there. And then she has two coral snap barrettes and a really pretty uh, kind of a smoky topaz looking stone on like a bobby pin barrette that I thought was really pretty. I included a few of these animal cards with tropical animals on them that have on the back all the 
um, data about the animals, a toucan, a manatee, and a Komodo dragon. And the last thing in the box is my uh, letter and photo addressed to beautiful child. And that's it for my 10 to 14 year old girl tropical shoe box. Thanks for tuning in today. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not already, and I'll catch you in my next video. Bye now.